in this video I'm going to show you what happens when you first log in um, to try and get onto the virtual environment so um, you navigate yourself to Internet Explorer or whatever browser you use and you navigate to https colon forward slash forward slash portal dot managed hyphen buy dot com that takes you into our portal page so uh, you log in with the username and password that we provide you with and it logs in now when you first try to log into the site to be able to use the site you need to have a very small application downloaded onto your PC um, which just allows the connection to take place now this is just called a Citrix client okay it's an ICA client so what we need to do is actually go here so you've read and understand the Citrix license agreement of course you can read that uh, at your leisure um, and then you click on download okay that brings up something called zenapweb.msi now uh, this is the application that you need to have to be able to launch your desktop correctly so if we click on run you don't need to have administration privileges to uh, install this because it's a uh, sort of like a web plugin if you like so we click on run and then that should just go away and do its merry thing and install for us as you can see here so it takes a couple of minutes to install um, once it's done you'll never have to do this again so it's just the very very sort of initial log on and once it's over with you'll never see this again or have to bother with this again unless of course you uninstall this application from your desktop so this is almost finished so I can show you uh, the next steps now when you log into our website what actually happens is um, you can automatically launch the desktop as you can see now if you don't set what I'm about to set up now you automatically get this screen here which is saying we're trying to start um, your applications automatically so you can either click start it manually now which will start the desktop but it just saves time and, and clicking if you can set it up so it can launch automatically now to do that um, to do it in IE 8 or IE 7 you need to go to internet options and go to your privacy settings sorry go to your security settings and go to trusted websites here so in the trusted websites box here you can add um, the HTTPS portal.manage-buy.com but also you need to add HTTP colon forward slash forward slash localhost add that also Okay, so once you've got both of those two in there, you might have other things in there that you've, uh, that you've allowed to have um, a trusted site, but obviously for the purpose of this video, I'm only showing you the two. So you've got localhost and the portal.manage-buy.com. Okay, once that's in there, okay that. Now what I'm going to do is show you what happens now. So I'm just going to start another browser here. Okay, so we go back to the login screen. Sign in. And now, as if by magic, it automatically starts. And when you first start see your desktop, this the first um, provisioning of a desktop here might take a couple of minutes. And um, this won't take too long because I've already already logged in like this, so. Uh, provisions it. You can see I've changed my desktop, etc. etc. Um, when you first log in, you'll see a Zen app uh, message come up. You need to enter your password in there and also click save password, and then you're free to use your desktop. Um, also, once you've done this, you will need to then change your password. So, if you want to also look at the uh, change your password video 
uh, on the site. Thank you.